My girlfriend is laying sick on the couch in the room next door to my office, which means that I've got, uh, let's see, 18 to 24 hours uh, until I will be met with the same fate. So it's time to see how many videos I can record in a 24 hour period. Today, we take a look at One Room Dungeon. This is a, a new demo uh, that is out right now. You can go play it, link in the description down below. But this is a, a mashup of a lot of different genres, okay? It's, it's a roguelike, um, it's an auto-battler, it's an inventory management game, uh, and it's also a team-building game, uh, where we are going to be fitting minions, artifacts, and items in a very tidy way in a tiny one-room dungeon, uh, to protect myself. Looks very interesting, and I'm, I'm excited to play it, so, uh, play along with me. Link in the description down below to go, uh, find this one on Steam. Wishlist the game as well, the five red arrows should have told you that. Let's play. So we, we are going to be Miki, or Mickey, Mikey, probably Mickey is what I'm going to call them. Um, each turn attack all enemies. My ultimate is each five turns activate all allies each turn effect. Okay, <laughs> that's, that's a lot to unpack. Um, this is just completely messed up up here, but we'll figure out what that means. Looks like there's going to be three other characters uh, in, in the full release of the game. As well as achievements and, and things like that. But let's play. Um, I'm going to not try to play on any difficulty level higher than, than the base for right now. <laughs> Just seems logical. So, click on a plus to expand the dungeon. Okay, so I can expand five spaces. Let, let's expand... That is a hell of an effect. Let's expand these for right now. Um, and then we'll see what's going on here. So, drag to the dungeon to buy. Drag to the shop to sell. And I cannot sell my Dark Lord. That's that's Mickey. Okay, same unit can be merged to level it up. Can do. Very cool. Uh, drag equipment or potions to their target to equip or use them. Some equipment and potions are restricted to certain types of units. Uh, you can place your unit in the dungeon's void to recover them. They'll receive a sleep status and won't join the battle if they're still in the void. That's good to know. And when units reach level 3, they gain an ultimate skill. Okay, so I don't have my alt yet. No, I'm level 4 to start. Okay, so our, our Dark Lord unit is a level 4. Um, that makes sense. They got they got 10 health. Can I, like, click you to, to see what some of this stuff means? I guess not. 2 speed, 25 uh, gold. Okay, and then we have some, some stuff here. So we got some dumbbells. Uh, when battle ends, survived random ally with attack gains 6 attack. Uh, and we got two of those. And a dungeon core. One battle ends, heal all allies. Those seem fine. And then a potion can be used upon use fully heal. So, look, I got a hundred gold right now. Um, I can buy everything <laughs> that's here. Uh, but we definitely cannot fit everything that is here. I can move this to over here and then buy the treasure. Increase gold received by 50% each battle. On purchase, gain random gold from 1 to 100. I mean, that's that's stupidly good. But we probably want some units as well. So so let's... I mean, let's mess around. Um, I'm gonna buy the treasure chest, which gave me... So we bought that for 33, where we were at, we were at 100, so that was 66. It gave me 17 gold. It's actually, like low balling pretty pretty bad on that one um but it's fine and then a, a, a slime right i think that i want a slime um on purchase increase hp3 to adjacent ally on purchase increase attack one to adjacent ally let's increase the hp of our guy here so that's that's on purchase so now he has 13 health, which I think is better, right? Um, and then, I mean, there's nothing else for me to do here unless I want to sell some stuff to get in some other units, but I I don't really think I want to. Um, I think I'm pretty pleased with, with what we have. This is going to continue to scale my... Well, can I... No, I, I can't scale the water slime like that. I suppose that I could re-roll to try to find more water slimes. It's pretty cheap, right? So then, then we can do this and level you up. And this is it's it's Super Auto Pets style leveling rules. So two levels to get uh, to the next level. 
Um, cool, cool, I'm with it. I'm with it. Premium toothpick can be equipped to all allies. On start battle, user gains two of an attack. So can I... I can't put these, like, on people. They just kind of exist. But I think that, like, if I buy this toothpick, that I can equip to you. Yeah. So yeah, now you have the equipment. And it says it at the bottom. Okay, can be equipped to all allies. Um, user gains two attack. Okay, cool, cool. I like it. Potion of Wrath. Um, add 20 rage to a user. Upon taking damage, gain attack equal to the number of stacks. Hit me with a one final reroll. Um, anesthetic. Equipment spellbook can be equipped to ally with HP. Add 15 regen to the user. It's pretty good, to be honest. Uh, I also like the treasure. And right-clicking freezes, which is brilliant. But I just instinctively went, you know what? Right-clicking should freeze. Uh, and it did exactly that. So let's level up this guy. He now has 22 health, which I think is is really good, right? Uh, I'm gonna lose my mind with the music. <laughs> I I don't know why. I feel like I'm I'm in like Walt Disney's Fantasia right now. Okay. Um, the anesthetic's interesting. I, I mean, I think it's really strong. Uh, it is extremely expensive, but I'm receiving 50% more gold. So I mean, it's it's like decent. Right, it's definitely decent. I think I'm just gonna chill. I'd, I'd love to level up the treasure. Um, we'll save a little bit of our gold and see what happens. So watch out, adventurers have found you. Battle will happen automatically when the character icons move into the center. The characters will perform their turn effects. Feel free to adjust. Okay, when all your units are dead, the game is over. And obviously we would like that to not happen. When all the enemy units are dead, the wave is cleared. Uh, I get my little extra gold and uh, so can I, I can't really move you or anything. It's, it's auto battler form. So they are just going to attack. I feel like we're going to be fine because these guys only have one attack. Uh, I gained my extra attack from my toothpicks. They start attacking. I start attacking. Uh, I'm going to bump this up to, to at least two times here. And my like tiny, tiny little slime is going nuts. So that went great. I mean, that went great. A hundred for the base clear? Holy crap. Okay. Um, that's insane. So knowing the, the abilities that we have here, I want to make sure that we have... I, I mean, we want to... We want to have people adjacent to the slime, right? So I'm actually going to do this. I don't know if the, the two adjacent is every adjacent, or if it's just, uh... Just one adjacent. Things to think about. We're definitely going to upgrade our, our treasure chest, uh, and we made money in that exchange. The mimic is, is intriguing. Um... A lot of health and a lot of... A lot of good attack on you as well. I mean, you're... I guess, I guess Mickey is, like, kind of crazy now. And, dude, I think the toothpick gave permanent, uh, benefit there, which is also kind of crazy. I love the idea of a slime build. I understand that it's, it's like, not good, but I, I do like the idea of it. And I'm gonna equip this onto you. I don't know if I can unequip things on you. So I probably shouldn't have equipped, like, two, two things to you at this time. And I, I can't sell you. I can sell you. But I'm not sure I want to sell you either right now. Like, I, I think leveling you up to each seven turns adjacent ally gains 10 health. Let, let's bring in another slime. They're going to start buffing each other. I'm going to do some rerolls here. Obviously, like, we want to get some big, big boys over time. But for now, I, I don't mind. Unequipped, equipped unit applies two poison to attack target. I, I'm gonna tell you, I, I actually like don't care about that. Give me one more reroll, I'm gonna level you up to level two. Um, we're getting good stuff going. My luck increase, chance to get higher tier items on reroll. Um, I'm also going to now play this guy here. It does buff both adjacent, and then I'm gonna combine you. 
I suppose uh, that was actually probably stupid, and I shouldn't have done that, but that's fine. Um, upgrade our treasure. That's now level 2. I gained a bunch of, of loot. Start of each battle, gain a random amount from 1 to 100. Brother, that's crazy. I'm starting to realize that we are... Uh, it definitely feels like we're, we're going to be finding ourselves with strong builds, right? Like... It feels overpowered right now, but it, it probably won't end up being overpowered in the end. Okay, he's now level 3. And the interesting thing is that we can level up the, the books as well. So, like, if I bring this in, I can't equip you to... I can equip you to there, but I, I can't equip, like, a, a doubled of it. I still think that, dude, once you equip, that's that. <laughs> you, you can't equip no more. Okay, I mean, I think we're fine. I'm, I'm just going to send the fight and see what happens here. Um, obviously, you know, our guys are taking a little bit of damage, but it's it's inconsequential. We're, we're going to walk out of this completely fine. Um, and I'm getting, like, extra stuff everywhere. Um, 320 here, which is crazy. Let's open up. I want to open up for a, a little a little T piece right here, or actually right here would be even better. Um, that's you, but I want you to not be like that. Um, you're a healer, which is interesting. You just get leveled up. You cannot get leveled up anymore, which is good to know. You're gonna get leveled up. I got four hundred money, man. <laughs> it's insane. It's absolutely insane. And I, I can rotate you. Okay, brilliant. Let's put you right here. If alive at the end of battle, adjacent allies gain three health. He only has one health. Okay. Um, Would have been good to, like, buff you. <laughs> but that's, that's okay. The other idea here is... I mean, you... you I, let, let's mess around, man. Let's mess around. So if I move this now out of here and I bring in another one of you, now you all gain some health. And then we can level you up like a little. I want to make sure this guy has health. And so far, this is this is kind of working ideally. Water slime is max. Okay, here's another one of you. Uh, premium toothpick is, is okay, but is not... Not doing anything that I need it to right now. Each turn, attack a random enemy. If alive, gain a luck. Also has one one uh, attack here. Each five turns, attack all enemies with luck times five. My luck is nine right now. I mean, 45 to all enemies every... That is crazy. Some strong units that we can we can pluck out of here, man. Or, or cluck out of here, if you're talking about the chicken. Slime King... You're intriguing. You kind of just do everything that the slimes do. Make all allies elemental perform their each turn actions. So these guys are elemental support units. I mean, that's that's like really good, brother. If we're doing the slime build, let's go all in on the slime build, right? Um, let's, let's just freeze all the slimes. Let's buy a toothpick and equip it to like the bird. I, I don't know. It's probably irrelevant. Let's let's go all in on slimes. I think that this could be fun. Um, I'll reroll one more time. Slime guard. He is an elemental. Add ten shield to allies in the same row. Uh, God, that could be extremely good too. I'm gonna want to like rework how I have my my place set up. I'm gonna freeze all your asses. And, and we're going to get interesting on the next one. I'm going to send it. Maybe scary, um, but I, I have a feeling that we're completely fine. I mean, we just hit the guy for like 30. Um, one of my slimes is dead. Uh, but he healed back to life. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. Um, 225. I want to now... I mean, I want to expand like a hell of a lot more, but I think that this is a good start. I appreciate this guy. I do appreciate this guy. I mean, adjacent allies gaining six health is is pretty sick. 
I just am like, I don't know if it's good enough is my problem. Um, just move some stuff out for now. The water slime we want to... I want to move this guy to here. Bring in a water slime right here. Buff everybody's attacks. But then we want... We want you to be touching the, the largest majority of things. We need to move this out and move you like here. And then move like these over here. Now we got like slime hell going on in here. But I gotta fit the treasure chest in because that's giving me a ton of money. So the bird loses some of his effectiveness on, on this turn. Brother, we just don't have enough space. I, I'm just gonna buy these guys so that we have them. Uh, uh, there, look, you got a little couple couple problems <laughs> with the 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 stuff going on there, but that is fine. Doesn't affect me in any way. Okay, buff you, beautiful. Slime healer, I'm not concerned about. Butter blade, unequipped, equipped unit gains 15 attack. Well, I mean. That's not bad, so just just take it. Here's more treasure. I'd love to get that to level three, to the point where I would I would love to just like expedite getting that to level three. The sooner we get that to level three, the better. Um, buff you. Our slime guard. Do you? Is it on purchase? No. Okay, so I don't feel bad just leveling you up over there. I'm gonna keep rerolling. I'm gaining money like crazy every single time here. Now, what would be intelligent is we're we're wasting away this bird. I'm gonna keep leveling up the bird. I, I probably shouldn't level up the bird, man. Oh, uh, dude, Doggle's kind of cute. <laughs> he's cute, but isn't, he's not what we need, okay? He's not what we need. If I'm going to purchase a slime, we want him to hit the vast majority of people. We, we messed up on that last one. That's the better play. And then you go here. I still have a ton of money. I mean, it's just it's just alarming how much cash I have. Bring this in. And then another water slime. The slime knights. No, I don't care about you. I like my slimes, don't get me wrong, but I don't care about you. Okay, this guy's now leveled up to full. Um, our treasure chest is also now leveled up to full. I, I still have like an infinite amount of money. Um, which is cool. It's very cool. I just need more space. That That's the biggest issue right now. Like, I, I can't level that up further. Selling it for 16. I mean, we're going to have so much gold that we won't know what to do with it. We already have so much gold that we don't know what to do with it. My units are ridiculously strong. Obviously, the, the like, wind condition is we got to get this guy in. Uh, which probably means the bird has to die. Um, if alive at the end of the tooth battle, <laughs> all allies gain five health. We, we need you to touch like the vast majority of people. So, so we're going to move these guys around because the on purchase doesn't matter. Each seven turns adjacent allies gain five attack. I don't know what turn we're at at this point. Or I don't even know if that's like during the match too. I don't know. I think that this is ideal because this is going to buff everybody um, for 9 health. Because you're going to stay alive. There's no shot that you die. Like I'm feeling I'm feeling pretty pretty good about our potential here. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just hit this with a next. Uh, save a little bit of money. I want to get my ass kicked, to be honest. Start of each battle, gain a random amount of gold between 1 and 100. It was, it was like 60-ish, I think. But I mean, dude, we're, we're just bodying. It is is not even close. <laughs> I, I feel good about this. And then everybody gets buffed, everybody heals. I'm getting 375 gold out of it. It's crazy. It's absolutely insane. So now you bring in this guy. Um, and this obviously goes absolutely insane. And you're buffing him at the same time. And I'm going to level you up. 
And I'm going to reroll quite heavily here. I'm also just buffing the Royal Guard over here. Eventually, he's going to go crazy. Um, I'm, I'm looking for Big Slime Boy. Water Slimes are also okay. Um, but we want to put you in a position where you buff the rest of my people. So let's move this for now, put you right here. We're going to bring in the Water Slime to buff all of you. That leveled him up to max, okay. Then we're gonna bring you back to here, you back to here, you back to here, you back to here, and bring back in Bird Brain for a little. Slime King levels up a little more. Water Slime, I believe you're both full. No, you're still at, at a small-ish amount. <laughs> Brother, it just keeps on... The complexity keeps rising. Okay, do this. No, you can't do that. Do this. Do this. Do this. You now touch everybody. Beautiful. Okay. I'd love one more. Yeah, just to get him to full. Okay. So that has now buffed everybody. It didn't buff my bird, but I'm going to tell you, the bird is is not the word. He, he is not long for this world, in my opinion. I appreciate him, don't get me wrong, I think he's doing great things for me right now, but he, he is not the future. He's not the future. The future is many slimy lads in, in one place. The quick stick. Unequipped gain speed. Could be good. Um... Dude, the, the Slime King's absurd. This is every turn that he takes. I need you to increase your speed, so now you're doing this, like, all the time. It's just going to make heals and crap flow across everything, man. I mean, it's, it's nuts. I'm, I'm gonna next this. No, I'm not gonna next this. I got money. Just, just spend your money looking for Slime Kings. Royal Guard, he's almost to full, man. Okay, I'm good. This squad is freaking lit, to be honest. Um, 150 gold. <laughs> it, it's, it's, I'm just wiping everything. If alive at the end of the Seth battle, all allies gain five health. Guess what? Five health to all of you. Just absurd. I got 500 gold out of that. Now, 666 raises some questions for sure, but... Is fine. Um, we want to bring in our knight now. So the best way to bring in our knight at this point is to probably go one, two, three, four. And it's all tw 22 allies in the same row. So to be honest with you, I think that that's fine. Because you touch the vast majority of our people. And I can make you touch even more by going like this to where now the only only person you don't touch you can't really see <laughs> the only person you don't touch is the king and the king is is just he's doing enough you don't got to worry about the king at this point so keep it going i need another king um we also need one more slime guard so we'll we'll get him um water slimes they're just full man Potion of level on use, user gains a level up. It's just irrelevant, right? It's just absolutely irrelevant. Um, Slime King. Okay, he is now, I think, max level. Again, it's hard to tell because it's off the screen. <laughs> there, there's little, look, it's a demo, brother. It's a demo. There's little quirks that are, uh, they're intriguing. He doesn't have his alt yet, so he's, he's not at full. Um, this will... Just kidding, maybe he is at full? Are you at full, my guy? If I bring you down a little? There we go. Uh, you're level 3. And you, you're attacking quick. I don't know why you don't have your ult, but that's fine. Um, the fact that we still have Bird Brain in here, too. I, I'd like my Elemental Guard still. But I, 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 I just don't see him anywhere. <laughs> elemental Guard, there he is. Okay. Beautiful. He's now leveled up. On start of battle, add 30 shield to allies in the same row. 
And every eight turns add 30 shields to ally in the same row. It's just absurd. Go, go into the fight. We're just going to wipe everything, man. These enemies are, they're not strong enough. I, I one shot like the vast majority of people. And then not to mention that we then start hitting with our alts. And I mean, are you seeing this? I took like no damage. It, it was just, it was just absurd. It was just absurd. Okay. Um, I don't even know what we need, to be honest with you. I, I guess what I would like to have, what the hell is this? I, I actually just don't care about this. I, I know that that, that sounds bad, but I, I don't care. Um, you're an elemental, which is interesting. On start of battle, summon a 2 HP 20 stone wall. I, I don't even know what that means, to be honest. Um, I think I want to now start start grabbing this guy and like he's oh never mind he's kind of wonky <laughs> he, he's a little wonky um we we can we can bring him in here just like this i didn't realize that he was he was a little wonky lad but that, that's okay he's got good attack okay um by the time we level him up i think i think he'll be kind of nice slime king is is full I think that another Slime King would obviously be, like, absolutely absurd. Um, the Gluttony Worm also looks insane. <laughs> but I'm, I'm, I'm sticking with my, my guns right now. Seeing where things go with me. Increased speed is, is not, is not necessary. Um, at some point I could probably remove the, the treasure. Because I'm making enough gold. That's not the problem. I mean, to the point where maybe maybe I am making enough gold, man. Now, if we want to do this correctly, I would remove you, bring you over, and then put you, like, here. Yeah. But then at that point, you might as well move you down here. And then you might as well move, like, you right here. Okay. That's fine. Is it fine? Yeah, it's fine. We're gonna have to rework the whole damn squad again in a second. But just just level up this guy now as much as humanly possible. The, the more units you have, the stronger everything is gonna be. So, so just keep sending it is the way that I see it. Now, the water slimes we, we have to full. I, I think you want to start purchasing Slime Kings again, because another Slime King goes to the moon. But let's let's now skirt you guys back into position, bring you in. I now have more units, but not my gold. Um, and to be honest with you, I'd rather have the gold one more round, so bring that back in. And then and then we'll go. And again, I, I just don't feel... I don't feel in danger at all here. I'm just gonna level this up to three and watch them all die. Um, if you look at the health of my units, nobody's freaking taking damage, okay? I mean, everybody is just, they're just cruising. 500 gold to me. Um, I'm going to do what I can to open up. This'll be the spot for our big guy. And then more slime spots there. Because you are all allies, not just adjacent, which is absurd. <laughs> it's like absolutely insane that that is a valid play. Um, gonna move you, move you. And then bring you over here. Move you to here. And then a one. And keep it going. I'm looking for kings. I'm looking for knights. I'm looking for for small green slimes. There's king. Looking for more kings, knights, and others. That's that's not the guy I'm looking for. You're what I'm looking for. Keep it going. You got tons of money. Just just cruise. I should definitely be uh, putting king. I should be putting. Items on every single person. I'm, I'm just ignoring items at this point. 
Which is like, it's not intelligent to do so. But for now, it's fine. Um, do we keep the king in? We would have to get rid of bird brain, I think. Uh, no, we don't. We can keep the king in. We can remove the, the money. I do like the money. I'm not gonna lie. But I think that king is just better at this point. Buff my speed and then watch the good times happen. At some point, I feel like I'm probably gonna get my ass kicked. But that time is just not even close to happening. It's hard to tell what's going on when you're on three times speed, for sure. Um, also, everything is just kind of buffing itself repeatedly. <laughs> and is now... Uh, I think I broke the game. Okay. Um, you put it on four times speed. It just keeps going. Uh, kind of forever. That... Not not really sure what to do about this one. I think that maybe having two kings broke something. Um, for what it's worth, one of my kings is is basically on top of another one. So he just keeps jumping between the two. I wonder, are they like are they switching? Yeah, they are switching. One ends up getting stuck there. <laughs> okay. Um. Look, it says 50 seconds until the end of the fight. Maybe there's a safeguard in place to just exit the fight if, uh, if things get a little wonky in the middle of it. Um, so I'll chill here for 30 seconds. It's a good time to talk about what I like about the game. Um, I think it's actually a really brilliant game. Y you can tell that they're, they're heavily inspired by backpack battles, but they've taken backpack battles and, like added their own twist to it, which is the idea of doing this like super auto pets meets backpack battles where you can upgrade the, the units, the units have certain abilities. I love the ultimate idea so that you can, you know, level up your units and it, it feels good. But I mean, there's definite balance issues. It, it's... I'm obliterating the game and I'm, I'm not very good at video games and I'm just like clobbering this. Um, so there's okay yeah it's just it's just broke broke <laughs> it's an early access demo okay uh the game is not out yet so i i look past bugs like this i look at ideas when i'm uh playing games like this and the idea that is here is super sound uh it just needs obviously some bugs fixed but also it needs a a balance patch like big time man money is so strong like you you have to scale if you're gonna have the money like this you have to scale up the price of things you you, you can't have this much you, you almost have to go the the super auto pets approach where you only have you know 10 gold per round and then maybe the treasure chest relic gives you an extra like three gold or something um doing everything in scales of a hundred makes it where it makes it more complicated for no reason, right? Like you don't need to just just divide by 10 and then keep it at that. Um, but dude, the idea is interesting. I, I would have loved to see, you know, if it gets harder as the run goes on. Um, but obviously I'm stuck in a, a bit of a standstill here for the rest of my life. So hey, uh, one room dungeon, fun game. Check out the demo for yourself. Uh, go provide the dev some feedback, wishlist the game. I think it's a really, really good idea. Excited to see where this one goes. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next Alexa look. Have a good rest of your day. Bye-bye.